Hello and welcome to TAMCO's Value Market Alignment Quadrant. And today we're going to talk about the differences between CapEx expenditures, buying and selling, and as a service buying and selling through the subscription consumption model. We've used our 27 years of experience to create this quadrant that speaks to the value and the direction of payment models with two audiences, integrators and customers. So a quick recital to this quadrant. On the left there, from the bottom to the top, you have value. And then from the left to right, you've got the market direction for payment models. Now let's first look at the integrator and the value and what's most important to them. And if we're good listeners out there, and we certainly try to be, building recurring revenue is the number one priority. RMR, recurring monthly revenue. That builds loyalty and profitability through contractual relationships and therefore builds customer lifetime value. So integrators are really trying to flip the script, change the culture to sell more services rather than equipment and lead with that. Pull through equipment, but be more service oriented in their offering, in their design. Then there's the customer. Customers are looking for use versus ownership. They want flexibility, they want greater control, they want obsolescence protection, and now more than ever, preservation of capital. So let's take a look at the, the way that, that these solutions have been bought and sold for years and years is starting to change. And the reason it's starting to change, because cash and CapEx, at the bottom left there, they don't align with what's important to an integrator. You can't build RMR through a cash sale. It's counterintuitive. The profitability, that's usually a one and done, so there isn't that customer lifetime value. On the other side of it, customers, they don't gain any flexibility, control, protection of obsolescence from a cash sale. They're certainly not preserving their, their CapEx or their cash after tax dollars. If you look at any as a service, specifically Tamco's technology as a service, We've tried really hard to address the value to the integrator, which is the RMR and all those things we mapped out in the TAMCO's technology as a service, along with addressing that for a customer. Greater use control, flexibility, and obsolescence protection, and obviously preserving their capital for revenue generating assets. So the next time you're looking to buy or to sell, take a look at TAMCO's technology as a service and embrace the subscription consumption model.